Bro, that nigga said some shit. I was in the car with that nigga. He said, we pull up with a. Bad boys too. He was like, how a nigga wipe his ass like that? That shit. Bro. Nah, bro. Y'all been seeing the, the nigga with the no nick on the. And yeah, I, something. Seen oh, she said, I gotta watch his back. That, that video. Nigga said, that nigga said. So what if you just chilling and a nigga run down on you? That nigga said. did a whole three six. That nigga said. <laughs> nigga said. Nigga said. <laughs> I said, oh, he said, he said, man, what you mean? That's too slow. He said, yeah, boy, you dead, boy. You ain't see the one with the balloon pop shit when the shorty was like, I'm trying to get with you. You need somebody to watch your back because you can't turn around. I got to see what you can't see. That's fucked up. And that dude was like, turn around real quick. And that nigga said, <laughs> she nah. said, see, look, they got you from that side. That's why you need me <laughs> type shit. That shit had me weak as fuck. Nah, that nigga said, that girl said, you know, you too, you too short for me. That nigga said, my neck taller than you. Damn. <laughs> nah, I seen a uh, balloon popping today, bro. It was little kids in that motherfucker. That shit fucked oh, yeah, me up. Oh, RT. Shit. Yeah, that shit I fucked me up, bro. Shit, I can't watch it. It felt weird as fuck, bro. I couldn't. Your kids up for that shit. I seen like a 16 second clip of it. That shit was fucking weird. What, what, what happened? It was little kids doing that little balloon popping thing. The 20 versus 1. Oh, yeah. hell no. And, and what? It was 20 little, little kids and little RT. Yeah, who the bro. fuck shot their daughter off of that? A, a bunch. 20 motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. 20 motherfuckers at least. And I don't even know Cloud is a hell of a drug, bro. It's the same shit that they was doing. Well, R. Kelly was trying to come sign. They were trying to come sign. But the difference is, they was the all the shit. same age. Just a little bit of a difference. No, it's still Just not a, okay. It's wrong. 100% wrong. But the difference is, they all were. At least it was kids. It wasn't no fucking. No, nah, I get what I mean, yeah. That shit, because it could have been where it's fucking weird ass women at the end of the day, just like that video of him at the club and they was shaking his day ass on him. That's weird as fuck. That's a kid. What you talking about? It's oh, a I video see. of Lil RT at a club and this grown ass woman throwing ass you on know this what's little so boy. Crazy to me? And that shit weird. Like, bro. I just feel like. I understand, like, like when we was growing up, you had like niggas like Bow Wow and shit that was young and they still in a club shutting shit down. I just feel like that's not cool, though. Well, even with Bow Wow, it still resonated with a certain group of people. You didn't see, you, I mean, of course you had the little mom or the cougars that had their little, ooh, what I do to that young cat, but they not. Nasty. Nah, they, they not. No, nah, they, they was, they was they, definitely doing that shit, bro. He was rocking with Jermaine Dupri, uh, Snoop, he, he all them. Saying, By saying this no, videos, I'm, I'm not like saying that, that it bro, wasn't happening, but woman in there what I will say is with. back then, broadcast. it wasn't broadcast. It's not a it was more. It was more structure, too. It's more, it's more social. It ain't no, it ain't no good way to put it. At all, because oh what God. happened oh to him that shouldn't have happened cool. to him. It, it, it's not cool in no form of shape or fashion. But at the same time, that's it. That's all it is. And that shit, that shit he's gonna. Showing, he's showing up a pair of pants. He's that that shit gonna that shit gonna have some long term dark effects. And that's all I'm gonna say. You don't do no but little boy or little no little child like, like this. Or no little same girl little like nigga that. that they have videos of him and they like nigga what's seven plus twelve and he in the car like oh. Uh, uh, Shut the fuck up! Are you serious? Same little nigga that's rapping about guns. And like I ain't never watched him about Lil RT, so with, I don't know about him. He be with um finesse two times, but no, 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 that's that's King. Oh, okay. King and, and, and fucking Reed. Yeah, mm. that's sad, I mean, bro. All these little niggas that's out here. He can count like a motherfucker. He can count his ass off. On all these niggas is running around here with these uh, grown ass men. But they not really getting them from these girls. These men is really okay. making money off these little kids, and that's fucking sad. But I I'm gonna say it like this: when I when I look at niggas that's taking these little niggas under their wing and doing that shit, I ain't gonna say I don't feel like they doing it in a negative way. I ain't saying that at I all. King, 
It ain't a yeah, negative way, but that can't get son. At the end of the he, he ain't got no he ain't got no parents or something. His parents like locked up. up. Yeah. Well, that I can understand. You taking under your wing and stuff like that, but the little but RT the same, situation, I feel like, is a whole different situation. But at the same time, like nigga, if you gonna take the little nigga under your wing, be a right? fucking role model. Yeah, you yeah, if you model. have make sure if you if the little nigga want to do this shit, bro, make sure he doing, doing it do right. Shit right. Yeah, you, you got. Sure you it's got not like you ain't got the bread. You got the you got everything that this you got the tools to build this nigga to make him a real respectable nigga and still get money at the end of the day, but you choosing to go about it a different I route. Say, I will say Finesse do that with King Grant. No, I have seen Finesse because check King on some real shit. I have seen that. It's been a lot of times that they try to come take you. You could tell Finesse got real love for King. Yeah, yeah, yeah it, it ain't no really, genuine. You it can, ain't no you can see that. Yeah. You can see that. Yeah. I, and like I said, I just seen Finesse like get on King on some shit. But like the way that they doing this little RT nigga, like motherfuckers is going to grocery stores picking this, this grown ass woman picking this nigga up. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen that shit happening to a king. Never. Uh, um, like grown woman, he be around a lot of shit that he shouldn't. You know what I'm saying? But it, I ain't never seen like no shit like that happening to him. As much as yeah. finesse is around naked bitches and all of that, nigga got like three girlfriends. He keep it to where it's respectable. Like, granted, some of the shit not every parent yeah, would agree yeah, to, but sure. at the some same of it, yeah, time, like, like the gambling and it's, all that. It's, shit. A, it's respectable to a certain extent versus the way because that they we because we know like. The love that them two really have for each it's other. Real. Like, King really loved Finesse two mm-hmm. times. Like, he really looked up to that nigga because he, he about saved his life. King was homeless when, was when Finesse met, met that nigga. Like yeah, that. his parents was in jail. King was, he was like on the no, street and, and shit like that. I get that shit. It's so, just like, it's way it, to the go same, about it. It's the same situation, but it's a little different. It's, and it's definitely ways to go about the shit for sure. Because what his point still stands at the end of the day. If you're going to take these little niggas under your wing, take them then you need to be right. a role model to them, like yeah. you say. Y'all feel like it's something we're doing as a culture? It's like, niggas with RT is that a hundred percent. They really rap. So when he did his little freestyle about going sixty fucking miles, they just started making him real songs for him. So everything he be rapping is some shit. Another nigga is rapping. same thing with Bowler. Yeah, yeah. But they was doing it a positive way for Bowler though. Bowler didn't start. He wasn't shit. cussing in his he music, he, and when he was grown, that's when he he broke. He literally went from kid music to teen and music that's a to adult. That music. is a fact. That is, that's Bauer true went as fuck. The tra- like he that's went true through as that a shit. Like I remember listening to we all Marco did, yeah, Polo yeah, sure. and shit. That's shit I'm listening to in middle school, and then now you like, you get to the new Bow Wow with you. Yeah. But yeah, them little niggas gonna fuck little RT up. Just be on top. A hundred percent. He gonna go to jail, bro. He gonna crash up. If not go to jail, he gonna do some stupid shit. Fucking freak, bro. He's ways. And that and that's what I meant on the long on them long term effects. You don't do that shit to no kid, bro. Because when they get older, they're gonna think that it's okay for them to do that shit to they to they little homies. You did on like no, you don't do that shit, bro. How do you change that situation? How do you fix that situation? Bro, the parents need to get their fucking kids and be parents to them instead of trying to make some money off of That's them. exactly that what it is. Exactly and- what she- Money and you can crop, make bro. money off your kid in a positive manner. Like it's kids out here that's doing like fucking like, kids, Bob kids, and like, and shit like that. It's like, other shit to do. He can still rap and shit. Yeah, but like he just it just got to be a more positive. Put some structure on that shit. Have that nigga in some like class. Even style. if you still swagging, like you know what I'm saying. Get that nigga a teacher, like, a clean tutor that, that go bro. around on. If he gonna be on tours, get that nigga a tutor that go around and help that nigga learn. Ain't no way in hell you rapping about all this extra shit, but you can't tell me what seven plus twelve is. Not gonna make him be a kid. On God, mm-hmm. and he gonna teach him how to get some money the positive he way. He was making him be a kid. But Casanet, because he a big ass kid. Casanet is in that realm where he still can. He he got that audience. He got that little adult audience, and then he also got kids that watch him too. Like we got, you got some grandma. I watch Casanet videos. He be funny. Grandma, grandma people. But watch you got sure. you got kids that watch him too. So he in that realm where he is that role model there, Lil Archie. Malibu, uh, Lil Malibu, the little white rapper dude. Yeah, he be. Doing. He a role model for LRT. He been pulling him underneath his wings, doing right. music he, with him, taking him to class. You can't, like, you, can't, you can't be a role model to And still rap right. about, yeah, I get it. Yeah. Especially when you ain't even, he ain't like, even got no guidance. That little nigga fucked up. Ooh. The little model nigga. That nigga that's nigga in that college. Went up on him, didn't he? That, that's the white boy that be rapping with Fabio and them, ain't he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. he's fucked up. I don't care if he in can college or nothing. Scooter, him. Oh, yeah. yeah. Can I do a hit on the scooter? Yeah. 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 But that little nigga. see that boy. Oh God, like bro, I just feel like bro, it's just as a parent, bro, you should always want better for your kid. Um, and better for your kid ain't 
out there hey. selling their soul at nine and ten, 10 on God. That's my son, though. I don't want my child to be looked at a certain way. Like, I don't want my son to be no street nigga. No matter what he came from, that's what he chose to do with his life as a whole. But I'm not, that's not how that's you not where we gonna head. steer him. You I'm don't steer him that way, yeah. You know, I feel like we're trying to like create. That shit. I feel like niggas in that situation are trying to create men, and the only thing they know to go off of is like all the thug shit they've seen in their life. You know what I'm saying? Fuck. So they're trying to bestow that upon their look, their young life or their little one. See, that's and if, if that's if that's a nigga's only, you know, picture of a man, mm. that nigga's fucked off in the first place. <laughs> On God though, because ain't no way. The only way you tell him, like even like growing up around. Said thugs like niggas did more shit than thugs. Yeah, bro, they wasn't just thugs though. Them niggas was men first. Like mm -hmm. my all my uncles was like straight up the thugs shit came men. afterwards. Yeah, and like, then they was then they was standing on business afterwards. Right. Niggas wasn't even thugging around kids like for real, for real. Like nigga, now, I ain't gonna lie. My my uncles and them was still young and shit when they had us, so they still had some learning to do. They was definitely thugging around niggas, but they wasn't steered. They didn't let us think that shit was okay at the same time. Yeah, yeah, they definitely wasn't finna do no shit like that. Like that was definitely dead. But they was still being themselves around niggas. I ain't gonna lie. So but what you pick up is what you pick up. Yeah, what you pick up is what you pick up. Molding these little niggas. Crash house. Yeah. yeah, like not even be crash house. Just 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 make me some money. Y'all being dumb as fuck, right quick. That's all it is. And nah, but you gotta think it's little niggas like Lil RT that ain't got big homies that's you know rapping and shit. And, that, and his mama is letting these weird ass people around her son get up under this nigga and, and just make him do the wrong shit. But shit, like what is his mama doing? Like shit, what? She on twenty v ones too. Yeah. Yeah, it's an evil world we live yeah, in. She probably she like clout her. though. I've been saying it. Clout is a hell of a drug. We gonna change the aim of the episode to that. She said, "Damn, y'all tag nobody no more." <laughs> Angelo, they mad at you. My bad, man. I, I tag my followers. She, you better follow somebody. She, what the fuck. <laughs> no, I'm playing. Don't beat me up, bro. Man, we say the introduction to no shit like that, man. Welcome bro, we pontificating, bro. We pontificating. They know who man. niggas is, bro. They know the vibes. Y'all hear? Shit, hear. At some point, we gonna just stop doing intros and just. Hi, Hi my name. To the shit. Hi, I'm Paul. <laughs> Literally, I still got that video. You doing that shit, D-Lo. I did that. Yeah, yeah, yeah on me, you did. Yeah. When we mm -hmm. trying to make them intros, we yeah. made that intro video. You sat right there in that chair and said, "Hi, Hi I'm, I'm Paul." Paul. <laughs> I'm crying. I don't even remember doing that. <laughs> I'll show you the video. I still got it. Oh, me, it just popped up book. in my memories not too long ago. Boy, you get old, nigga. Your birthday gets fast. Yeah, man. Damn near thirty. It's a blessing. You hear me? How was your birthday, boy? boy? Listen. I just recovered from my fucking birthday, boy. Yeah. Niggas got it high as fuck. He was boy. tripping, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. That bro, nigga. That nigga tried to overdose us on. <laughs> and he <laughs> and he get, just kept got, saying, "Roll up, roll up." No, fuck that. Like, you passed out. No, he definitely <laughs> passed out. Bro, about you, bro, about checked out for real. When I came real, back from bro. the hospital, you was on the couch. You just got. I was smoking before I got there. Dog. I know. And then by the time I got there, bro, like, roll up. Bro, so and he like, kept you know, I saying had roll it. one of his blunts. Exactly. <laughs> he kept saying it. Roll up. I'm like, damn. Boy, I went over <laughs> <laughs> hey, to the point that nigga said, don't bring shit. I'm like, hey, and I'm papers. like, don't bring no weed. I got all of that. Just just bring just leaves, lighters, papers, whatever the fuck. Don't even just come ready to roll up. To the point when I got home, I didn't want to look at weed. Bro, that <laughs> ass. I, I did not roll up. I looked nothing. at my tray was like, my lady was like, hey, got me line. fucked I up. Did. I ain't doing none I, of that. <laughs> I went to Vine after I love bro shit. I definitely went down there and smoked. I didn't even finish the blunt. Boy, I was down there stuck as fuck. Nigga, my like you said, roll up. I was able to go somewhere else. I went yeah, you, home. Man, I know the hoes. You wild. Wow. Yeah, no, you strong home. for that. Because, nigga, once y'all left. Once you pulled that cone out, I knew it was done. I damn near coughed up three lungs and only got two. Boy, that cone was you. Yeah. That you know, cone crazy. fucked. You didn't even finish the fucking cone, Did, man. It got put to the side. Yeah, yeah, y'all want to know what's even crazier? I got that bitch outside in my car, right? That now. motherfucker was then put nigga, to the no, side. The house, nigga was like, yeah, I'm going to say this for us for another and, day. He said, I'm, no. And <laughs> I talked to him the next day. He said, I'm bringing it after the show. We're going to finish it after the show. I said, oh, bye. You had to smoke like a hookah. You had to hold it. Like with two hands, like this. Hey, yo. You, yeah. You had a double fist, and I didn't bro. even make the jokes. <laughs> I wasn't making no types of jokes. That was wild work. <laughs> that was hey, wild bro. work. She I said I wasn't making no type of jokes. Nah, nah, real shit though. Like you really did have to, like it had to be like, at an angle. Up, you had to hold that bitch up because nigga, the weed. Would've, would've tilted would've, and fell out that motherfucker. Yeah. Bro, to I the was point so when I was seeing blunts, bro. Like that. Bro, I was tired of seeing think, the motherfucker. You gotta think, bro. We in a room full of fucking. 
comedians. Yeah, bro. that don't bro, you know, Oh my bro. gosh. Bro, I don't I'm like comics. Tell you, bro. Yeah, bro. She, she was. Oh my God! When I yes. got your brother with the hater shit. Hey, and they was smoking. I was like, Hey, put hey, this that on nigga your pulled, That nigga funny as fuck. What's that? Bro. Oh, they were sitting on the ground. Yeah, yeah, we were sitting yeah, on the yeah, floor. Yeah, we were sitting on the floor. We were on the floor. The yes. funny part about it was, but we all just kind of like migrated outside for no good fucking reason. Bro. We went outside and then everybody got lower and lower until everybody was on the floor. Let me get. Let me tell y'all something about my about my house. Like it's. It's nice, but it ain't no too seat. many pl- it ain't too many places to sit in that motherfucker. No I live alone, so it ain't too many places to sit in that motherfucker. So with that being said, niggas had to make do. Niggas was on the counter, and niggas was. <laughs> yeah. My back got kept getting hit by that uh fucking the the thing. The cabinet. Like, Fuck that cabinet! Okay, I'm been, getting down. Like, bitch, I can't trying to sit down. Yeah, you sit on the counter with your back bent in. We, we done went and had a whole piece of picnic. Yeah, bitch, party high. out on the floor. <laughs> sit on the nigga patio, Chris. At like hey, ten o'clock at night, I've been smoking a big ass nigga. I feel like nigga, that was I had a cool last birthday. That shit was I, I, hold, that shit was a memory. I had I had a cool last birthday. That, I, that's literally what I wanted to do. Get high as fuck, and that's exactly what happened. Oh, boy, high and as so, fuck yeah. was an understatement. We was up there with giraffe nah, ass. I don't think, I'm trying to sit here. I'm trying to sit here. I'm trying to sit here and think, have I ever been that high before? Like I'm 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 quite and certain it, I've never just sat there and smoked that much weed before. The bowl that he had, it didn't matter how much you grabbed, it looked like nothing changed. Bro. No funny shit though. Nah, it nah, looked like the, I swear yeah, to God, bro. I'm rolling. I'm rolling we, like 18, bro, rolling 19, blunts, nonstop. Out, like 19 grams in blunts. Like Doinkies I swear to God, the blunt. Bl- oh, you smacked the shit out of him. God, God damn, 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 girl. girl. <laughs> Talk about that chronic. <laughs> <laughs> she, she got excited. <laughs> the weed was. Oh, sorry. The weed was on the weed. Damn, tremendous. I'm gonna snatch tremendous. I'm gonna snatch up my nigga lash. What's wrong with you? God, God damn. Talk about that chronic. You keep giving shit to me like. Your yeah, heart started pumping off fast. She was feeling that shit. Oh god! Hey, I ain't gonna lie, bro. It was a point in that motherfucker. I was so high, boy. My heart started. Bro, that <laughs> nigga, I told this nigga, I'm like, bro, like, I'm, I'm done. This, I'm ready to start smoking. Hey. My head is like, nah. I looked at this nigga Diaz, bro. He got a button in his hand. I got a button in my hand. Just trying to pass him. <laughs> No, so it's like, to the I'm point like, where nobody want to get the blunt. They like it's on you. I'm cool. It's on you. No, it's on you. It's on him. It's on, and nobody wanted to get bro, the blunt. Nah, bro. So nigga, it was so fucked up. We in the kitchen, bro. So I swear to God, I wrote a blunt, bro. And this motherfucker just kept on coming back. Right? <laughs> I passed it, bro. It'll come back to me. I'm like, bro. So I start fucking rotation up. I start passing. This all the time. That's what it was. That was your ass. I'm like, nigga, no, because we just keep <laughs> this motherfucker back, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That's how our sessions be. Mo- even like outside of like my birthday, but yeah, definitely on my birthday. But that's really how it be. Though. Sometimes, bro, it just be so many. The ratio be off. It be more blunts in the air than it is people. Yeah. And so it get <laughs> so it get to a point where you just got, bro, just pass it, bro. Hey, just pass. Somebody gonna get it, bro. Like, like, nigga, I started taking blunts outside the people. Don't yeah, bring them yeah. bitches back in here. <laughs> this is the outside. Bro. Oh, God, y'all got that. Hold one of his weeds, bro. It'd be like. Hold one of his <laughs> weeds. Like, real though. Like, motherfuckers, like, what do you want to eat this day? Like, fuck, nah. D Lo passed you a blunt like this, this like here. <laughs> Yes, here. <laughs> I saw, and this the mouthpiece. This the blunt, like here. That motherfucker roll to perfection, like here, bro. I don't want that. Like, he keep looking down at his blunt. He like, I'm like, what's wrong? He like, man, I'm trying to figure out who the fuck I'm about to pass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really want that shit. I'm fucking hot. Literally, hey, right, we went to the field, the field kick day, the uh, field day shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I tell you, everybody walking up, bro, who rolled that shit? Can I hit it? No, 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 no. no, bro, no. We on last night, bro. This lady came up and she's like. Who, why is y'all roll y'all blunts that big? This nigga D-Lo gonna say, I be telling her no. <laughs> hey, Trey, play, Trey blamed it on me real quick, and then Heck gonna be like, yeah, I tell her the same shit. She don't listen. That, I'm nigga, that like, nigga Heck said, I be telling her she just wasted weed. <laughs> I'm sitting over there like, ain't that a bitch? And then, no, that don't even top it. This nigga had me walking around looking like a cast, uh, damn patient what? with a tumor. Why just walking up. Cause this nigga brought what? Some what? A I had some weed with me, bro. That's he had, had some weed. He had a, a baby. Some weed. No, a pillowcase. Okay. Everybody else's version of some weed. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga walking there with a tote full of weed, like yeah, hey. like this with the damn shit. It's lit. This nigga got singing karaoke, holding his shit, like this yeah. He been singing Temptations. On him, boy. He like, <laughs> Like, brother, is you cool, bro? <laughs> bro like, like, to the point where they know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tego, they stop 
Hey, they stopped me thinking I was carrying the gun. Tell us what you got on your shirt. Oh, that nigga Mikey gonna say no straps in the club. <laughs> <laughs> it weekend. ain't that. It ain't that, Mikey. And then they like, why you got so? We know it's legal, but damn, I'm, this ain't this even me, no bro. This is not weed house. This ain't even me, bro. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, tell me. Back when they see too much weed, bro. They be taking they be it back. So it's, appalled. It's th- when too much weed in a blunt, they be taking bro, it back, bro. I'm telling you. <laughs> What are y'all doing? What goddamn nephew? What you doing? With <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta understand. Yeah, I said the, the pistols they steady evolving, even still to oh this day. God. So what they had is different from what they, they, they was walking around with them. They be looking like Port Potter and that motherfucker. <laughs> clack clack. Like, hey, I'm weak. You need to ride with all of that. Yeah, all. You gotta put all of that? Nah, nigga, no, no, no. Hey, nephew, you don't need to go nowhere. Hey, my mama, hey, I swear to God, my mama hit me with this. Like, uh, it's a new day. Them little six shots, we need more than that. It's boy, a new day now. Bro. I'm in the, I'm walking out the house one day. My mama said, boy, if you need a gun that big, you need to stay your ass in the house. <laughs> I said, mama, I said, listen. Do you see what these little niggas be walking around with? Like, this is nothing. I'm like, well, I'm scared with this on me still. Like, for real. Bro, nah, for real. I got my temperature checked the other day. <laughs> all right, young nigga. Yup. Hey, all right. Car my full nigga. Up. Car full of them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nigga said, what's oh, the yeah. word, huh? <laughs> Shit. No. Hey, bro, hell Shit. has no fury like a car full of young niggas, bro, with shiesty mask on. In the kid, bro. In the kid, bro. That's <laughs> terrifying. Oh, bro, I'm going to check the trash out. It almost hit me. Boom. I'm like, hey, slow that motherfucker down. They're like, what? I'm like, so that motherfucker down. Boy, the door opened on that kid, boy. He said, don't do your job, huh? You got a nephew? Oh, God. You got <laughs> I don't want no smoke. Bro, you, life is about choosing your battles. Yeah, Dead homies. On me. Even if I had a gun, I wasn't about to. Yeah. I'm about to hop out with some shit. Y'all got four switches in the car and at least one ARP. Yeah. You hear at least, uh, at least one. That car don't one. belong to y'all, so they ain't finding shit. So y'all don't even care about. It's about five ski masks in that no bitch. Kids. They uh, is the kids. They, now, now they probably got kids, nah, but they, they just don't do give a fuck. Young niggas, bro. They the kids. Them young niggas don't give a fuck. They're they probably like 13, 14 years old nowadays. They don't give a fuck. I'm talking about, yeah, bro. You would have up that switch on me, boy. I would have, boy. Hello? Boy, you been out there tap dancing. Uh, on me. <laughs> yeah, hell no. I would have. Yeah, I ain't. Them the, them, the, them the worst ones, too. Them 13, <laughs> them 13 and 14 year olds. Nah, nigga, them little niggas is violent, it's, bro. It's, it's a difference between like the, like the 18 year olds and 19 year olds. My nigga Lee like, gonna say, I like them type of niggas, man. Yeah, said, I like that, nigga, that nigga Tego said, why? That nigga said, that nigga <laughs> said, said man, because they let me get home, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Them young niggas be ready to, for you to say Boy, something crazy to their ass. Yeah. My mother went to the fade trip. A young nigga hopped out the car. Hey, uh, you got a dollar on you? I sure the fuck do. Here you go, man. Boy, Boy take that with you. Hey, I sure the fuck do. Like, I will go buy it for you. Oh, bro. I, I, I get the shit. Nigga, I'm in, a, nigga. I'm in the hood one day, bro. I pull up to the gas station. This, this young nigga walked up on me, and he was he wasn't he ain't even look grimy or nothing, but. <laughs> Still a little nigga. Oh, God. Still a little <laughs> so nigga. He walked up, he walked up on me. He was smiling and everything. He was like, um. He asked me for a quarter. Mm. He was trying to get some shells. I'm like, I ain't got no change, but I I, I got you. Don't even worry. I went in about that nigga two packs of sweet woods. Oh, God. Oh, oh, me. Nigga. You see me out here? Just, uh, hey, oh, oh, God. God. You see me? Uh, you see that car? You, uh, see, you see these glasses? Oh, crazy. Yeah, bro. Re- remember, remember Unk blessed you, nigga. What's the word? Oh, hey, do y'all feel like it's crazy, though, that we onks now, bro? <laughs> Shit. This I, I, I remember being a little young, dumb the, niggas. Right it's the circle of life, bro. I'd rather be Unk than a dead-ass, bitch-ass nigga that just... You right about that? Trying to be in competition. With these young niggas, I swear to God, bro. That is a young man's game when they can have it. Oh, nah, oh God. To make my shit sound fully, but it, <laughs> it's a blessing to even be this age, bro. So yeah, I ain't even finna stoop back that low, like niggas. Oh, God. Like the guns is regular no more. No, they're not regular, nigga. Ain't no pow. Bro, no, bro, gun, bro, guns stop being printers. regular. <laughs> they are building their guns ago, with three D printers. How hard it was get your hands on a fully and now they take nigga what? And these motherfuckers, they're creating them. <laughs> Literally Fuck passing printers. them out. Fuck finding that. the fools like finding the leprechaun. They're nigga. modifying them bitches. Niggas send them niggas to the service. Bro. To the gulag. Why they just did I mean, they is drafting yeah. niggas. They need to go, bro. Go do something. <laughs> oh, God. Like, go like direct that niggas. energy into something produ- productive. I guess. Because yeah. fuck, bro. Go go put a switch oh. on a nigga for this country. Oh, God. Go get Ben Laden. Freedom, bro. For the right. 
Why can't everyone become a counselor when these little niggas be on that tough shit? Brother, what's going on with you? you hey, okay? but this but this woman right did home? give us this woman did give us her business card last night. She do mental health shit. I might like, and bail bonds and, and bail bonds. Hell yeah! So I definitely yeah, yeah. I, I got both her business cards. I got. Cards. I, got I told her like, hey, should I ever need you? I know I'm, who to I'm, hit up. Yeah, on God. I, I need you for the that latter end of that. On God though, <laughs> you, you just never know. The mental health. You do, and that's really what I meant when I told her, should I ever need you? That's really what I was talking about. On me. For the mental health? That's what I'm Something wrong with you. <laughs> that nigga Heck is probably the most sane nigga I know. No, that nigga. Is, mm, never mind. I ain't gonna start that with you, Heck. I've been chilling, man. You have. I'm gonna leave you alone. My mental health is in, in a good you, state dog. right now. I've been chilling. Hey, I got a question for y'all, though. I got a question. I got a question for you. I got my days. What's up? Would you rather fight 15 14 year olds or 5 20? I mean, or 5. I'm sorry, 25 5 year olds. 25 five year olds. Yeah, I'm snooping that way. I'm gonna take one little kid and use him as a weapon. I swear to God, I'm gonna be snacking the shit out of him. Swing him by his arms and yeah. And my mama, he gonna have the time in his life. So I can what? use his feet as the weapon. And I'm slugging shit. I might use his head quite as kept. Nah, I ain't gonna do That's that. That's crazy. The head ain't got enough. I mean, aggressive for these kids. That's a good question. Five year olds built different so nowadays. Built out and they running. Belt to ass is different. I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah, belt to ass is way worse. Than leather belt to ass. Belt, nah, nah, nah. Fuck the leather. The studded leather belt. Oh, but, but you said how many fourteen year olds? Fifteen. That's death. Yeah, you jump. They, 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 they got switches. They probably got switches. Are they fucking like they? They like they fourteen. They doing what they doing? You a whole different. Yeah, yeah. Oh Once your nuts gosh. drop, you yeah. It's your man strength. Yeah, that's death. Them niggas gonna stomp the shit out you. I said it was all niggas. That shit don't the matter. That shit, bad too. that shit don't matter. Them little, them little girls will kick the shit out your they ass. They got switches kick on them the too. Shit out of your ass. Switches and mace, nigga. Bear mace. Oh, God. And knives. Knives, oh, brass knives. knuckles. Knives. Hey, knives that come out the comb with the little... Nah, bro. Nah, man, that bitch nah. probably just got a. Nah, nah, that a bear. To, a that bear may say is the female version of a switch, though. That's a fact, bro. Said, well, y'all see that girl pull up and let that that drive through. That drive by with the mace. Oh, she let them bitches have it, bro. Oh, I seen a bitch walk down on a bitch with the bear mace. I, I just seen a bitch like, chase a bitch with bear mace and try to spin while she was chasing. Lie, I just seen a video of a bitch throw some bleach on the bitch car. And they tried to pull off and got smacked. Watch yeah, watch on me. Instant that karma. Flip. Damn. Damn. His boyfriend shit. <laughs> Instant karma. Oh, nigga. That, that shit flip. No, for sure. This completely off subject. It's not like nobody like uh, getting into it or whatever like that. I seen two studs get into it, bro. It was the funniest shit I've ever seen in my life. Oh, One stud walked in and caught her stud getting beat. I mean, getting whooped. So it was two studs in the relationship? Yeah. Well, That's crazy. One one of the bitches looked a little male. I'm not sure if she was a stud or not. <laughs> she looked a little aggressive. That's all I said that much. But like the other ones in the bed, booty butt naked, and they're getting her shit whooped. I seen that. By a dude? Nah, by another woman. Oh. And wow. they're getting her shit whooped. Oh, she wow. said, get the fuck Was out. it by another stud? <coughs> Maybe. That study love is crazy. Study, study love, love, bro. Love. Nah, it is though. That stud, stud politics is crazy, bro. That she, stud, that stud came problem. in there and snatched the covers off. I said, get the fuck out of my house. She's like, I'm dropping my clothes off. Fuck your clothes. Get out. On me though. Kicked her out booty butt naked with the blanket. Yeah. On oh, God. They got a new shit where it's like. Give me that stud. <laughs> they, they got a new shit. It's like stud on stud shit. And then, it's porn? Well, no. Stud on like studs are dating each other. Porn? Now. What? Porn? No, studs are dating each other now. Oh, uh, studs dating each other? And work? did they have it to where studs are now dating feminine men? So they're breaking mm -hmm. the system. Yeah, they are. Oh, wow. Breaking the What the? F so you're going to be the boy and still date a man. And you're going to be just, just stay mm -hmm. straight. Yeah. How about you just? I don't want to bring it up, but I see the, the video of some dude the other day boy getting what the fuck. Well, she feels like Beat she's on. masculine, and he feels like he's hey, Cammy. That Drake nigga. Yeah, yeah. You know they say that those energies are just they're just the energy we all have them. What feminine and masculine? And, and that's a fact. But but but, 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 but still though, like. I'm not under. I feel like a man crying is feminine. <clears throat> <Damn>. Really? No. <laughs> it, depends, it, it depends on why he cries. I think yeah, you cry depends. when your ribs was broke. Nah, nah he wanted to. Because on certain scenes of the temptations do make me emotional. I ain't oh, gonna God, lie. Nigga. Certain scenes of the yeah, temptations. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. When I see, anytime I see like kids being fucked over or something. Yeah, yeah nah, yeah, that, that, yeah. I don't be liking nah, that shit at all. I'm gonna keep it all being with you. Died on four brothers, that, nigga, yeah, nah, Jackie nah, nah. died, bro. That is still making me cry. Oh, God, nigga. Can down in the comments? I really can't like any any more. I'm, I'm watching Law and Order SVU lately, bro. And my nigga uh, Stabler gone now, boy. I ain't gonna hold you. That nigga been gone nigga. for years. No, 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 no. I watched it from the catching up. Shut the fuck up. I watched it from the mm -hmm. beginning. Shut the fuck up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he just now catching up. <laughs> I watched it from the beginning, so I got a real crush on Mariska Hagate. I'm trying to take her down. Mm. What? Yeah, let's take the let's take the Benson. I want these things to her. 
That's either here nor there, though. Yeah, yeah, she's always been lie. pretty it, attractive. It, it, on the next episode of SVU. <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about consensual. Hey, yeah, she did it. Right she come on. And then hey. it boom, 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 What? No, I watch Matt Lock. That's how you know you an old nigga. And then watching Matt Lock. I've heard of that shit. Nigga, that's an old nigga show. That's like watching, on God, I was just about to say, that's like watching Mash. Mash. You nasty Mash is when I knew I need to turn off the TV. That's nasty, bro. I knew I was up Ain't that like the A-Team or some shit like that? I knew I was up too late. Ain't that like the A-Team or some Rambo shit? It's like going on the Rabbit Mash, nigga. When that came on, it was time for bed. Sixty minutes was it? Nah, that's when you know it's When I seen that. Sunday night football. I mean, right before Sunday night football. So we always, you know, we had to watch a little bit of that. <laughs> like, 15 minutes on guys. <laughs> that nigga said we had to watch a little bit of that. Fuck no, my papa though. had the red TV. He shit switched over right on time. NFL package. See, see, nigga, you grew up with a silver spoon in your mouth. My spoon see, was nigga, silver. It was, a, it was, bro, it was, it was, it was, it was the plastic silvers. I had a pay. I had a We used to have to go. I had to go over one of my friends' houses who had that shit. I ain't gonna lie to you. One thing my papa loved was football. One thing he was gonna make sure he had was his football. Nigga, my dad loved basketball. You know how many times I missed fucking Laker games, nigga. That ain't got nothing to do with me. My papa, you my daddy my was a basketball made it fanatic, nigga. I, oh, nigga, I was lucky. Kind of that, I was lucky to catch. All I can say is, papa lucky made it happen. We had direct TV growing you know up. What's so crazy? My pops was my pops from Cali. He couldn't fucking stand the Chiefs. What? Not only was they red, but he's from Cali. Yeah. So, nigga, he hated the red. He hated the Chiefs. He hated that I was a Chiefs fan. Well, <laughs> then he signed me up for, you know, South Suburban. And guess who I played for? Chiefs. Chiefs. <laughs> Pissed. Y- y- and y'all colors was red, too. Yo, Dang, oh, y'all, you know he was y'all wasn't even like was purple or no shit like no, that. No, that. Bro, was red, bro. We had the Kansas City logo and everything. Oh, man. Yes, oh, boy. Yeah. He would never, but every time he came to the game, he'd wearing black, bro. I swear That's me. That's me. And you know, be hot to the motherfucker outside. You got to be honoring yourself to put on black. I swear to God, bro. I respect it though, bro, because that's some shit I would do. So I respect it. That shit. If it was a blue team? Yeah, on God. So I respect it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they can be the Royals all they want. They could be whatever color I mean, they want. Black. I just ain't wearing that. Is he gonna wear one, you ain't gonna wear one of his jerseys, bro. No. Oh, he, gonna have a, he gonna have a black shirt on with a ten. I have a say. sign with my little nigga name on it and shit. Fuck all that. You have a Demilo Jr. Gonna say Damu pops on the back. <laughs> <laughs> God, hey, give my nigga a red mouthpiece. Blood, just, just give my nigga a red mouthpiece. Just so they know. You know what I'm saying? He's still banging on guys. <laughs> he's still, he's still, he's still tired. Every he's time his son do a touchdown. A red, a red, 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 it was kids teaching that, kids at the city. Yeah, there was kids, bro, on God. So it's like, but at the same time, he used to dead ass tell me like he ain't really condoning me doing that shit too. But that was just like our, right, I don't know, bro. Bro was just a, a gangster. You do know what I'm saying? Yeah, some hey. shit you can't turn off. Yeah, some shit you just not gonna turn off. But you know what I'm saying? You, you y'all gonna you know? Mm-hmm. They gonna know. <laughs> That oh, shit. Crazy. Y'all want to talk about some sad shit or keep it I don't want to talk about no sad shit. Okay. I'm gonna keep it <laughs> Don't be a sad ass nigga. I want to talk about some the dope we gonna smoke after this podcast I'm or something like that. I don't want to talk about no sad. Nice, he got rolled blunt. You can eat a dick. No, you can eat a dick. Young you man. lucky he ain't skinny. Your shit. To, but I thought about. It. I just put a little. You better be lucky you didn't, because if I'd have turned around and hauled off on your ass, I would have beat you like a nigga. No type of wrong. I'd beat you like a nigga. No. You done got hemmed up and been and burst. I'm oh not that other nigga. Hey, bro. This nigga shot a little brother funny as fuck. Why you say that? The nigga just texted him and said, a nigga birthday in three days. What we on? And Mars, this nigga 17, bro. <laughs> you ain't on shit with us. The fuck? Man, take that little nigga out, bro. Nah, we did tell little bro he's gonna pop out with us on the barbecue. And he turned 18, bro. Take that nigga to the strip club or something, Chris. Not no strip club here. Yeah. Boy, Miss Cookie ain't going for that. She Boy. might. You're not getting to no strip clubs at 18, though. 
You ain't? No, nah, you, you gotta are. be 18 to dance. You gotta be 18 to dance, you gotta be 21 to enter. Them bitches be what? 16. Man, what? Any gentleman's club, you have to be 21 yeah, to enter. Yeah, you gotta be 21 to But if you 18, you, you can dance. But you can dance too. Yeah. You can dance 18? Yeah, you, you can dance like 18. I don't like that at all. I don't like that. At all. Like that. If you push and pee and you know the right people, though, you, you can get in. Oh, God, you gonna, you gonna get in there. I was in that motherfucker. I don't like that. I didn't know that. I gotta fuck with the strip club whole thing for me. I don't like to hear that shit. But you know what's so crazy? Nah, facts. When we was 21, going in the place you had to be 25 to be in. I used to be like, bro, I can't wait to be 25 to go. But my nigga, I don't know you want to go to them. My nigga B had us getting into clubs, nigga, when we was. 19, 18. Sure he still, he had to be, had us getting into everywhere. Like, they ain't, all you had to do was say, hey, they, they with me, nigga. And they let us walk right in that bitch. 2016, bro. boy, we got into <coughs> so Excuse me. clubs and shit, boy. It was crazy. Like, bro, we was always in a club. <laughs> I hit my club early See, I was getting into What was that like going to the strip club with your pops, boy? I know that shit lifted a mile. I go to the strip club with my auntie. We throwing ones and throw a that ain't that ain't the same. Uh, I mean, oh God, you getting the right of passage? You go with your pops, like yeah. Nigga, this how you throw that money, son. Oh God, God like, like nigga, yeah, nigga, smack her on the ass with you it. Throw the money, lap dances and all. Hey. First I'm time I went to a strip club, I'm about to buy you your first lap dance. That's how dude was talking that one night. No <laughs> <laughs> uh, way. No, no, no. I'm talking about dude. Dude. Oh. No, buddy. Uh -oh. buddy. <laughs> <laughs> talking choppy in the motherfucker. You got to get your money's worth. It's what you got to do to him. Free boy. Free boy. You got yeah. to grab it all. Walk to Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. You better nice. hey, she better show me some. She got a little you gotta put on it. Y'all scared. That's what he said. Y'all was scared. And that nigga said you gotta put a finger in there. Oh me, y'all was scared. Y'all asked what he Y'all was scared. Oh yeah. Y'all better get up in there. I don't even know this woman that Oh god, I don't know this woman that well, sir. You might need a technical side I grab her the wrong. She didn't know her last name. She what are you talking about? More for less down there at She did more for less. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that makes it that 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 fucks. It up. I ain't gonna lie to you. It fucks it up. Yeah. Once I find out, like, you know what I mean? All that shit's like, bitch, I don't even know. Put this back in my pocket. That was still about. fun, though. No. I ain't gonna lie to you, boy. A oh, stripper, your peoples. A stripper can't never, you know, come over here acting so diddy. Heck, I can see you wiping a stripper, bro. I'm you can see me as fuck. Boy. Oh, some Drake shit. Wife in the Heck, I could, I could see that shit too. She just had to be cool as fuck. She got to be cool as a motherfucker. She got to be like a, a whore either. Oh god, that's like, only two things. That's she do. crazy. Not even on no like, not this even on no what she do. You know. Oh god, she's she getting paid, nigga. The Boner Garage. That's <laughs> <laughs> But y'all think so low of me, bro. No, bro. Yeah, <laughs> think low of you. But like, pick me out, pick me out. I know you like like women that's a little bit experienced. You know what I'm saying? She gotta have some type of like charisma about herself. No, no, like, but y'all know my no. biggest pet peeve. Is a bitch that everybody doesn't see. I ain't talking about like an OnlyFans bitch. Well, nah. don't let her. <laughs> <laughs> you have it, bro. Uh, but nah, bro, like you childish. But nah, well, niggas ain't shit, bro. But nah, I feel like, bro, like if she a stripper, bro, and she like, is she cool? Is she pee or whatever? You fuck around wife when she broke y'all a little bit of that stripping fee or whatever like that, nigga. Don't let her have a a wide body. What SRT. heck? Woo! Oh, no, nah, she come wide by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look stars at her. in the room. Nigga, what? With her, with her that nigga heck gonna be in there like this. With her guy stitched in the ceiling. Hey, with, with this a nice, nice luxury apartment in, in <laughs> North Kansas nice. City. Where you get this from, my guy? Oh, oh, she gonna have a nice ass a luxury apartment in North Kansas City. No, she gonna have a loft. She might let her back on the first night. She got a loft downtown. She got a a wide body SRT with the stars in the ceiling with her name stitched in the uh. Hair rest. Oh my and she getting, better be And stupid. she hella fine. I'm, no, you just met her. You know hey, what I'm saying? And she hella fine. With a track he hog cuffing with her. Cuffing her. He cuffing that bitch, bro. And he taking her home to Dukes. Dukes. Nah, I ain't taking her home to Dukes. Dukes. Fire Dukes. Fire cuff her. Dukes is gonna be shit. He's just gonna tell her like, you know, she she do hey, real estate. Dukes, Dukes don't Dukes don't hey, 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 she never She an Alvin Ailey dancer, nigga. That's what she do. I ain't gonna, I Alvin Ailey. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I feel you on that. My mama don't want him. She don't want to meet nobody. Else. I be bro, I be telling my mama she cannot meet females. Bro, Alvin she fall in love with bitches. Like, bro, she be that bitch be her daughter. That's how my grandma is. Like, but she loves, she be loving me. I be like, that's how I be knowing I be bringing dope bitches home. That's from Alvin Ailey. But still, like, that's from Alvin Ailey. Get off me. It ain't that fucking funny. Oh. She was in Alvin Ailey doing ballerina. 
Ailey. I did because Alvin Ailey back in the. What we learn about you? Back in the no. Back in the. She said back in the seventh. Before after back in seventh grade, she was doing Alvin Ailey dance choir. Back in seventh grade, they had a camp every summer for sixth grade girls going into your seventh grade year. They had Ailey camp. No, no mistakes. So I went to Alvin Ailey camp, and we went to school. We went to Paseo over the every year. I mean, every day they picked us up, took us to Paseo. We did. No, tell them the rest about the tap all of that, and then the picture that I post every year on the first of February that commits like Black History Month, the picture that's black and white, like I look like a fucking slave. That's from me and Alvin Ailey. That's what I look like at Alvin Ailey. I was and running I can around picture, there, like the fucking photo on my head, looking right like now. seven <laughs> years of fucking slave. What I had just scraped the skin off my forehead wow. from uh on the slide. I was on no on the swing and I was leaning back and when the swing swung back, I was still leaning back, so I just caught the ground. Mm. Took the skin right off my forehead. Two weeks oh, later I had to take shit. a picture. I mean that bitch. I mean, it was pissed. Yeah, I look like I a fucking slave. That's why I use it for the first every February. That's sick, bro. To commence Black I History. I wouldn't have let my child take no picture. Bro. Oh, it wasn't no lex. Alvin Ailey, they got a yearbook. This is a yearbook. I don't know where the fuck you can find it. They take a lex. picture. This is my child. Nigga, you're not taking a picture today. And if any one of them niggas up there got a problem with it, tell me niggas come. I mean, I I didn't care. I, good seven. I mean, good what thirteen? Well, no, I was like yeah, about thirteen year old. So me didn't give a fuck. I didn't give a fuck. It's skin. It'll grow back. You see, I don't have that mark no more. Body I was wondering what that mark was on your forehead. <laughs> it ain't here. I be looking in the mirror sometimes like, is it ever going to come back? Do you, can you tell that it was gone? I know that shit hurt it, though. What? I look exactly what it was. I'm talking about it went from. Because when I scraped it, booty. it scraped my shit pink. <laughs> So it went pink to brown to you know the, all them <laughs> ugly like dirty two, colors. Two yeah. Shit. Well, yeah, I fucked myself oh, no, up. The forehead though. Shit. <laughs> Who the fuck? Shit. She was over there looking like young boy. It was okay. like oh, weak as fuck. You know, like the uh the shit that skateboards, like the little shit that yeah. keep grip on skate. That's what the ground was like. like, like oh we. Yeah, basically same thing. Been on that show uh. Thousand ways to No, 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 no. Remember the show back Ridiculous. in the days? Oh, God. <laughs> nah, I think it was on MTV. Was was like, Scarred. 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 Mm -hmm. Fuck. Scarred. That's what I'm talking I about. Not you not watched it. Why did I not, not watch, watch it? it? I ain't like seeing Boy, it. Boy, that shit was crazy. Nah, <laughs> Scarred was crazy. crazy. I be hating seeing that shit, too. I though. seen a nigga, he was grinding on the road, whatever, came down, he went no. like, boop. Hit his meat, boy, ruptured his shit. No. Nah, the nigga that ripped this shit out. It was a nigga that happened, that happened to a nigga in college. My freshman year of college, he was playing football and he's his shit got stepped on. Nigga, and it popped nah, it. Please. If I swear to God, it popped it. Hey, it popped. It. I, when we went to school together, nigga, it was a nigga, bro. I ain't gonna say his name because you probably still in can't see whatever like that. But this nigga had like a safety pin under his fucking pants, whatever like that, to keep his pants buttoned up. Mm. We at gym doing laps. This nigga still had the school pants. The safety pin must have flicked out. And hit that nigga in the shit shit. In the wee wee? In the wee wee. In the oh. wee wee? To the point where, like, nigga, we start, ah, ah, ah. So everybody stopped and looked back, like, oh, shit, you good? He's like, ah, ah. So the coach could run over. But our coach, only, like, at this time, our coach only had three fingers. No, two, two good fingers. You know what I'm talking about. If you remember yeah, what I'm talking about, we had two good fingers. About, he went over there, grabbed a nigga like this. Come on. Oh, God. <laughs> Get off me, coach. Grab that nigga. Took him over to the corner, right? Oh, God. <laughs> Took him to the corner. Grab a strong head. <laughs> nigga, no, the coach asked him, like, are you okay? He said, no, nah, it's, 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 it's in there. It's in there. It's in there. <laughs> like, I guess the safety pin went in the, like, oh, in the hole. This nigga in, oh. this yes. nigga in basic training like, bro, touched it really, some. It hurt just to hear this shit. Bro, this nigga in basic training right touched some uh, had, poison ivy. him and carry him out the gym. This nigga touched some poison ivy in basic training and then peed right after. Woo! So his shit was, uh, he had to go to the hospital and explain that. But the nigga who got his shit popped, his voice, I swear to God, I kid you not, his voice was up probably three optics until I his bet. shit healed. Hey, one time when I was like two or three, the toilet seat slammed down on my shit. That's what you ah. get, you little freaky ass. I never did was sat down on my shit. I was trying to sit down on my balls. He was trying to shake it. Nigga, I was peeing. That nigga was playing with his nah. balls on the nah. toilet seat. The worst thing ever is the motherfucking toilet seats that don't close because they got your your auntie to fucking put a thick ass cover on them. <laughs> and that motherfucker don't sit all the way back to the thing, so it just be like, nah. Uh -huh. I got a story. Yeah, like, bro. A little family member of mine that got a tick stuck in his dick. Oh, wow. A tick. 
That you was doing something you had no business. Nah, so doing like we was little, or whatever, like that. And like our, our the, the house we lived to next door, nobody never cut the grass, or whatever. But this nigga That'd kept so running nasty. back and forth through the fucking grass. Something he wasn't supposed to. Lo and behold, this nigga had no motherfucking drawers on. Bro, That's what you get from Uncle Commando? I guess a tick jumped up and got on that motherfucker. We went back in the house. My mama was like, "What's wrong with you?" He like, like something ain't right. Like whatever, whatever. Mama was like, nigga, what happened? He like, well, I was running through the grass and all of a sudden, ah. She was like, all right, let me see it. Nigga must have. She's like, oh, that's a tick. I'll be right back. Mom was nurse. She went and got some, oh uh, some tweezers. And the thing about a tick hard. is, you it cannot just right pull off. a body out. Because a tick head, it'll it's continue saying, to burn mm -hmm. into your skin. So when you peel it, when you pick it, you got to pick, twist, mm -hmm. pull. Or you will leave the head into the, or you'll leave the head in the I can turn the nigga in the room. Boy, I've been in there. sound like Rance Allen. Boy, whole nigga. Boy. Let me hear. Let me hear. It's crazy. I mean, it sound like YTB fat. What he sound like? Oh. <laughs> I don't think you get hurt. I don't think if that's your hurt, mom. That's crazy. Nah, I'm just saying a motherfucker pull off a tick off your meat. A tick. I'm in there. <gasps> oh, I mean, I'm in there talking like Prince. <laughs> shit. I when I got the closest, I feel like the closest to getting a tick pulled off your shit is getting a Brazilian wax in. When I got a Brazilian wax, oh, I'm fuck no. screaming. I, I cried. Like Brazilian wax and a tick is the same thing. Boy, get a Brazilian and tell me about something. Don't Ooh, talk man. to me about it. When I say hot wax off my took, nuts, they took my about? coochie lips. Said, they took them. I took this girl to get a wax from Tara, so I'm sitting there. Why be bro? All you, you hear is screaming. Screaming. That's all you gonna hear. When I got mine done, that's all. I thought they was in there sodomizing. I'm talking about good. Like it ain't no like ah. No, I'm talking about ah. Like I got a video, it, like I was screaming loud as fuck, and I know the other establishments heard it. Yeah, other stuff, sir. If you went deal one, she, I mean, she went deal one. I'm gonna fuck you up. Don't try to transition like that. Hey, hood. She went. Got I ain't talking about. Yeah, I ain't talking about. One fit check. She went and did it. Nah, this bitch that was doing. Ask me. Ask me if she could do it on me, bitch. I'll be damned. You put hot wax on my nuts and rip that shit off. I'll Boy, beat you what? up. No, 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 no. I'll be a broken bitch, skin, bro. On the ball skin, God, bro. It's so much loose skin, bro. What? That shit like that shit like elbow skin, bro. No, 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 no. That shit sensitive, bitch. Why do we got the same skin on our knees and elbows though? That's crazy. Work. Sensitive places, bro. What? Oh God! What? <laughs> Think about it, bro. It's like elephant skin. Same skin. I don't believe that, bro. Bro, take your arm and do like this. That's on your knees and your elbow. Now feel your feel your arm skin. <laughs> feel that shit. <laughs> Touch it. Listen. Tell me that's like your ball skin. Oh, no. <laughs> you're lying. There's no way. I mean, the same. The fact that you I mean, sat and no, touched your nuts and then touched your so elbows one day was like, hmm. No, the same skin. I'm telling you, it feels similar. It feels similar, bro. I'm telling you, but it don't feel the same. It's too similar, though. Is what I'm saying, bro. I got. I gotta Listen. go home. <laughs> I gotta go. Watch, watch. You gonna go home, bro? And you gonna look at your knees and then gonna pull one of them? Same shit, bro. <laughs> you get extra, bro. I'm not going. Swear to God, that's not me being extra. My nigga said I gotta go home. <laughs> Nah, uh, you know they say that uh, pussy and like the so side of your cheek has the same texture. That's facts. I can believe I, I that. I can buy that. I can believe that. And I'm not gonna hold you. But that's about yeah. yeah. I done had some cool to feel. That, 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 it, it, that's about what it feel like. It get yeah. the same sensation. You went back. It, it's, nope. it's something like that, yeah. That's something about what it feel like. <laughs> this is this is what a Brazilian wax sound like. Hell no. Do you think you can handle a Brazilian wax? <laughs> No, I'm not. Same no, thing, no, bro. no, not same no, thing. no, she really not. She re they, I'm not gonna hold you. I can, I can, I can see that one. I, Either she went really there hairy than a motherfucker. Yes, you gotta go two months without shaving before you, you can get a Brazilian. Yeah, you, get, you, you cannot go with no little stuff. I know it can't be too low, but you don't go in there with wolf pussy. They, they literally, before you sign up for the Brazilian, they tell you. Two, two to four weeks without shaving. I'm just get a Brazilian. I know how this shit work. I, okay, so she, well you gotta two you to have four to, weeks. Yeah, but after you keep doing it, that's I one month. It, like it <laughs> Bro, you know how much. coochie hair grow? You said two months. I said two. That's my fault. I meant two week, two to four weeks. My fault. But a month of coochie hair is a lot of coochie hair. It is. Oh, it is. It's a whole lot of, and it ain't no. You can see jungle out. It's what y'all would have on like, y'all beard at like, any early. early. You can't. You they can, don't tell you. You can't use a razor. They tell you not to. They tell you not to. Take a razor, that motherfucker. But if you have a fro on your coochie. And the motherfucker is at least a three. Take that shit down to a two. Or some if you go, if you, if the barber, if you go to the barber shop and the barber tell you, don't cut your hair, 
You're not gonna go they don't cut a couple that. inches off of it. You're gonna not cut your hair until you come and do that. They don't say that. But I'm saying if a if you got instructions from somebody to not do something that you're not gonna do, you're not gonna go against the grain. Well, like Lonnie said, that's your first time. Like I'm talking about, like yeah, no, it definitely you still uh, have it gets to better after, after you, your first you time. Keep it doing takes it. about six weeks. You for get like to used grow. to it. It takes a long time. I agree. I'm not disagreeing with you, but I'm just saying that going in there with wolf pussy and expecting you to feel good is crazy. No, like, you have to go in there with wolf pussy. It's not even that it didn't feel good, but that never just hurt. So you don't expect to feel the way it feels. Yeah, like you know it's gonna be so Like you know how your vagina look, right? And so when they put the hair on the lip. They're and going they in like the lip. Yank it. Like imagine, like no, that's imagine. Just and then when they open it up and they get the little hair to be on in the end, y'all be liking that, that shit. Oh my god, you think your clitoris is gone? Y'all be like, liking that shit when they get to rubbing. They, they no, with that ain't warm, none. with that warm. First of all, the shit, wax is not. It's not no warm wax. Yeah, that that's shit why they is hot. It's hot. The shit hot. Ain't nothing sexual about that hot ass wax in your coochie. Oh no, I done heard different. I done heard different, bro. I done heard different. Oh God, I can't even here make the funk with you. I done heard different. I have heard some pain. It get too. I've heard pain. It get too kinky. Wax room. Well, well they must have went to the Ooh, same like bitch shit, multiple da, 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 da. times. Because if you go to the same bitch multiple times, then I can see Eventually, that happening. Eventually, she gonna, she gonna yeah, try to... Yeah, I can to... see that happening. I, no, I'm not agreeing to what you're saying. I'm talking about seeing it to where it's not she gonna try to as difficult. So, bro, I couldn't wax them. As soon as that motherfucker needs to look... You going to jail? Right. I mean, I'm just saying. A little happy ending. That motherfucker is a little crazy down there. It look like a honey bun. You feel me? A glazed one. I swear to God, bro. Boy. That's the best shit ever, bro. And then after the wax, you're not supposed to do nothing for two Please, days. Boy, bitch is getting that slammed. That same day. That same and day. That's, that's, same day. Not, that's good. not good. Because you still have open pores and that type of bacteria. They ass is dead ass be saying, like, nigga, I just got a wax. Like, nigga. That shit is not safe. I'm trying to see it. Oh, God, they trying to broadcast. That's that like saying hair. I got a cut. The hair grow back too sweat fast. in it. So I got every cut, second counts. Come put some sweat in it. That's exactly what they said. I got a cut. Come put some what sweat if I in come it. Over there, detoxed. Don't no no matter. No, it's no not for balls. you neither. Tell that to them bitches. I, I, they tell us. How they just do it. You can't get mad at us. No, I ain't mad at you. I'm saying it's not good for <laughs> you. Get mad at us. It's her coochie. She, 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 can, let that, she can let that bitch go raw because that's exactly what it is. Go raw. Tell me she just came from European Wax Center. I didn't know. I, I came up here as hairless. You picked her up. You a goddamn lie heck. You heard her in the lobby. You said it. I didn't crack her that shit. Nah, he ain't crack her. I ain't gonna lie. I definitely crack some fresh waxes though. Like I, Some of that bald eagle, <laughs> I, seen, I seen a little wax strip on it, a little piece of the wax what? strip on it still. I'm what? weak what? as fuck. She need, she needs to fire her wax lady. Oh god. She needs to fire her. Yeah, she needs to fire shorty. Cause how you leave a strip? Oh me, I did, I did pull it off. Let me get that. <laughs> hey, no funny shit. You ever seen a bitch with a piece of tissue in her butt? No. No. That's I funny. just asked, what would That's I do if y'all seen a bitch I'm, with an ashy crack? I, who is that that I talked to? That? Ashy was that? Is yeah, Ashy. A ashy Ashy Crack. crack is different. Fresh out like, the shower. Yeah, that, that's really a sign that you just got out the shower. You okay, just ain't okay. put no lotion on your butt. So you saying if the crack was ashy, it's not stopping you from hitting? I'm no. moisturizing. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna it's gonna get it. It's gonna get moisturized. Like. What about you? It's gonna get moisturized. Don't trick. I'm about to turn you into a cream pie. This movie yes, about to turn you into work. a, a, a toaster popsicle or something like. That I'm about to say the only time I, I feel like every time I ask a nigga that though, they say the only time I ask you booty is acceptable if I see her get out to shower. That that means. Means. You gonna know? You, you gonna know if she got out the shower? She gonna smell like no, she like just that. got out the no, fucking shower. Like you just got a shower. If a bitch pull up, if a bitch pull up to your crib and pull no, bare no, ass out and it's no, ashy, it, no, no, that is kind of crazy. Like bare no, ass, pulling hairy ass, ass out is crazy. You ain't never done with that. That's hair? definitely crazy. I didn't had, bro. It was a bitch put out some hairy ass on me. I didn't even want to fuck. My dick got so I don't even want to fuck no more. Nah, that's not cool. Like her booty cheeks was hairy. No, like or the hole was hairy. The crack was hairy. Like the crack. Pussy was shaved. Crack. Crack. Now that's crazy. Yeah. Now that's crazy. Well, so you, might have, you might as well just left not, your coochie you hair. I would have gave one. you a pass bro, for that. What? You know how infuriated I was, man? You might as well just left your coochie hairy, bro. At what that the, point, at that, you, at that you, point, you got to You damn near. Because you had to know I was going. You damn near by there when you're shaving. You had to know I was going to give you the two for one special. So you, <laughs> the two, two for one. 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 So that's that's I started making like, posts on Facebook. Now, bitches walk around with horse tails and shit like that. <laughs> I'm being petty all on the book. Ashy, Nasty bitch. Ashy, hairy butt. Oh, no, ashy butt, I'll accept. This is like I said. You probably got out the shower or whatever. Nah, like nah. But hairy are we talking about. A lot of women. We're gonna talk about this off camera. Cause your mama. We're gonna talk. All right. She young. Miss Banks on me. Hi mom. Hi mom. We love you. Oh God. Oh God. Yeah, we're gonna talk about this off camera. Cause ain't no way. Crazy. 
You would do it. You would do it. You would do, do what? it. You would braid that beard. Smashy buns. Oh, no. Stop playing on my time. Oh, You would no. braid it. It's crazy. It looks like you braided. I don't even I mean, like it. I ain't going to block you, but next time you come over here. Next time you come. There you go with that whale well, shit. Well. Next time you come over here, make I sure you got this shit like slim. Yeah. But you, you still gonna do it? Look, huh? Next Listen. time you come over here, make sure you got that trim. I got to see. How do you through. tell her? And then put a rubber band on the back of it. That's the bottom of the through. braid. <laughs> that nigga gave her a trash bag. Not that sick as fuck. Put a rubber band on the bottom of the braid and you tilted hell, it up. Bro. You hell, I swear. He put a rubber band. See it through. She didn't. No, you didn't. Like he literally did this. No, you didn't. When? Recently. You took nah, it. No, not recently. That's nah, crazy. I'm about to say, boy, you a wild nigga. Yeah, heck out here braiding booty hair for all you booty hair bitches. I'm about weak as fuck. Boy, he he braid booty hair. Come to my crib with some booty hair. <laughs> he gonna braid it, permit, lay it down. That'll be the last time you come in my home, boy. <laughs> 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 ah. <laughs> Ain't going in the group chat. Ain't going in the group chat. Shit, you might go on Facebook, bitch. Stop playing. I see you, boy. That group chat is a diabolical place. Hey, you don't want to be in the group chat. All of them. All of them. All of them. If that shit ever get leaked, bro, whew. Yeah, they might send out a Rico charge, uh -huh. boy. Honestly, I ain't, my name Bennett, I ain't in it. They gonna hit us with a CC. Matter of fact, we something. need we need to change our names. They gonna hit me. Everybody change their name. Everybody change their name. We've been dying for pure conspiracy, bro. How about we? <laughs> then we get it. We get hit with a CCE, a, a continuing a criminal enterprise. We getting a Rico charge. Nigga, we getting a conspiracy. All that. Them niggas up and throw away the key. Oh boy, I, hey, me and Debo gonna headline the charge. Then yeah. they gonna be like, boy. You niggas are diabolical. Yeah, right. They gonna have a pyramid, and I'm at the bottom just. Uh huh. I'm about to tell. <laughs> I'm about to tell. Uh uh. Your mama said y'all cutting up. I'm out. <laughs> See you. You you miss. You missed a lot of it. You missed the constructive. Respectively. You missed yeah, the constructive you missed, you part. Came you came in at the wrong time, mama. You came in at, you came right in at the wrong time. You came in at if the wrong time. If you would have came in like ten minutes earlier, it wouldn't have been as bad. Yeah. Yeah. Conversation. We, it's we, adult we, swim. You missed. We, we, we missed was dropping. We were dropping some game for the it's Cartoon Network for the yeah. for the kids at first. It's Cartoon Network. Yeah. We were dropping some game for the kids at first. Nick at night. <laughs> <laughs> Not Nick at night. No, Fuck swim, that. Boy. This is B E T after dark. It's a whole bunch of robot chicken going on in here. <laughs> she. Robot chickens. Now, that, now that's a show that I knew when that came on. It was time to go to bed. No, no robot chicken. I didn't I like. Ro robot. I didn't like robot chicken. Like no, robot, robot chicken no. came on at eleven o'clock. No, nigga, but I didn't like it. it. I didn't like no, it. It was too many random shit. It was cool. It was cool. That little cat in that orange suit. Is that that? Not my, not my Who is that? Who is the dude? That's another show too. Did y'all use that cow and chicken? That hell oh, yeah. yeah look at they was wrong as yeah, fuck. Yeah, they was on there eating, wow. eating cookies and butt. Of course I was. Oh watching. God, <laughs> them, that butt? show had too many and into butt? innuendos. Nigga, you see, I think it was a uh, cat that was uh, doing something, or no, chicken was doing something. Somebody eating something. Eating some butt or eating some cat or something like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> and they was really up there getting to it. They was like no, it was the episode form? when he was cutting the log nah, with the fucking with the fucking sure. uh, was, log. With they, the, they had a table chainsaw with a bowl full of cookies and a bowl full of ass on the on the table. <laughs> they definitely did. It was like bootios. <laughs> and they had and literally it was an episode where he was cutting the log and dude had a belt on as like the saw but and the log right was on. The ass of the other animal, so he on the <laughs> saw that <laughs> bitch. That show was not for kids. I don't care what nobody this say. A lot of shit. A lot of these kids shit got inappropriate shit. Yeah. Nigga, SpongeBob as fuck. Like, I was watching the memes the other day, right? bro. Oh my gosh! And <coughs> it's a scene where it's one of the memes is big as fuck. I know exactly what you're talking about. Little memes in his head, they on fire, right? So it's like a some type of fire scene or something. But he goes stands. In front of the fire extinguisher. Like you pissing so on him. It looked like he pissed it in his hand. Mm. Wow. And I look up yeah, at my bro. shorty. And then I look at my kids. <laughs> I'm like, this shit ain't right. <laughs> oh, God, this shit ain't right, bro. <laughs> Nigga, you seen the second one? Yeah, bro. Bro, crazy. Minions itself is basically a, a wild cartoon for kids. I love Definitely. I Illumination love minions, is a little like, different. King Bob! Oh, oh, shit, bro. Banana! Beta <laughs> Bori! I talk shit, about bro. fucking, uh... I just knew Sausage Party was wrong. Oh, my God. That's not even a movie yet. It's, it's a TV show. You know it's a yeah, show it's a now. It's a show now. Yeah, it's a show now. I gotta go watch it. Hey, it's actually funny as fuck. I ain't gonna lie. I low-key gotta watch that shit. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. yeah. yeah That's my good. fuck. No, bro, y'all gotta watch Mary King Town, bro. You keep saying this, bro. I watch like y'all ain't watch that shit, bro. Go watch it. What? Bro. It's adult uh, King uh, animation. Nah, it's a gangster shit. Yeah, it's just a. It's a. Ain't that? Ain't that what? Ain't that what they like? Uh, 
I call it a it's drama. It's a show, right? Yeah, it's a drama. It's a drama, but it's more the gangster shit, though. And where they, like, they own the prisons in the town or some shit like that? Or something. I ain't make that far. You got to ask that. Come on. It's, so, basically, like, so it's a group of brothers. Like, they all do. Like, one of them was in jail. The the other one, he like a cop or something. And one of them was, like, the mayor of the... He not the mayor, but, nigga, like, if you got some... Your partner in jail or something, you need some protection on his ass or something, you gonna talk to this nigga. So the the older brother he gets smoked. The 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 nigga that was the brother that was in jail, he come out well I don't think he was in jail at the time, but like yeah, he get out or whatever. He started taking the shit over. But basically bro, like nigga, you got you got the Crips, you got the Bloods, you got the Mexicans. white supremacists, and you got the Russians. And so basically this nigga job is to like make sure like this shit don't boil over from the jails to the streets. Like nigga. Yeah, I know I know what show you're talking about. I never I seen a uh, watched clip. It. A chick got uh, a chick killed a nigga on that shit or whatever like that. Like he was in there trying to fuck her or whatever like that. Oh uh, yeah, the guard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She, and she pregnant about a nigga and she yeah. What? Is that your favorite jail series? Mary King Sound. Uh, that, that shit. Got nah. You. My favorite jail series, Orange Been Black. I fucked up. You just now get on Orange Been Black? I about saying. Nah. See, I ain't never watched. See, I, I like, I like I started shit. it. I haven't I finished it. I already stepped in the motherfucker. I like shit when niggas getting their brain splatters. Mm -hmm. Like, boy, yeah, what? they be they be over there getting off on it. You said you got her card? Huh? And I watched Prison Break. You got that card? Prison you didn't call her. Niggas never got the fuck out of jail, though. That's why I stopped watching that shit. Man, I made it. It's like, it's a few seasons in, but they end up making out eventually, bro. The brother ended up getting transferred to some old shit, though. That shit was stupid. Yeah. <sighs> Wait, what show? Prison Break. Oh, I like Prison Break for a little bit. Just Never me, got into that. Just let me know when Power come back on. No, me. I'm still trying to see how Tyree will go about this now. Y'all watch the boys, do you? Yeah. No, I tried to, bro. I hey, that shit is them. actually kind of dope. <laughs> that shit is. I, could, I look. I couldn't fathom me holding my bitch and the nigga hands, running through her. And yeah, and like he run through my bitch and like her hands just leave right a here. pink mist. That ain't nothing yeah. with a pink mist. <laughs> Pink that nigga said, I'm sorry. That nigga said, gotta go. And ran the fuck out. Bitch ass nigga, what you doing? Yeah, I can't bitch. stop. I can't stop. I can't stop. Help. <laughs> That's my bitch. I don't got help. That nigga said, Sarah? Ah. Sarah gone. Boy, what? Sarah's. Sarah's. Boy, Sarah's nah, I seen that episode. Nigga. That nigga must have shrunk down to this size, whatever, like that. And Started whooping their ass. Sheena's gone. They put that nigga in a little, bo a little bowl of cocaine and shook that nigga up. Bitch yeah, ass, what the fuck are you talking with? Literally. Well, I ain't gonna lie, bro. The, the part that really fucked me up, yep. bro, uh -huh. was That's when exactly the, how they did that. When they shot the fuck out, I swear to God, bro. When they, when they, when they brought the little, the little girl on, and they was trying to make her a superhero or whatever. Yeah, whatever. yeah I'm talking about you. And yeah. the nigga told her basically, like, bitch, you know, if you're gonna be a part of this, you need to let me see about that. Yeah, I'm talking about. I said, boy, that's nigga, in the comic right. books, nigga, they made her actually do it. Yeah, I heard she got ran through. They in made the comic her do book. it. Yeah, they made her. Yeah. Folks, huh? Yeah. yeah. Mm. Nah, so <laughs> another scene, nigga. Blind dude walking there, but the blind dude got like real good hearing. And the nigga like Jet Li type shit. Homelander like, oh, okay, that's cool, that's cool, boy. So what would happen if I went like this and smack the sides of his ears? Niggas started bleeding profusely. Like he was like, bro, now you get to use this another fucking blind guy, bro. What am I gonna do with you? I can't do shit with you. That's crazy. Oh I right. smoked home. And this is the boys? Yeah. Yes, it's all bro, when I tell you, this shit crazy, nigga. Bro, crazy I knew it was fucked up, bro, because they put Fucking they niggas. version of Aquaman, you fucking octopus. Watching TV and shit. That's tight. Hey, sometimes. 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 sometimes the TV watch me. It got to be something like really like, boy, if I must definitely be at home watching TV. I ain't if power I'm watching watch. whatever Hezzy watching. But no, my kids ain't control the TV. I'm in there. I'm watching TV. I'm watching. He will not sit down if I control the TV. Shit, I gotta watch that shit on Netflix with them black superheroes. Super? Super See, sale. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I just feel like anything with black superheroes is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, well, I'm, I'm you, not I ain't say that, bro. That's how some chicken and boys. But you not wrong. Because <laughs> when you got to think about it, bro. They, they purposely make it some bullshit. The way that they bullshit. make it, the way that they make yeah. it, it makes it a lot of sense. Because, you know, sickle cell is not a, a, one of the rare genetic uh, mutations that only African Americans can have. So with the show Super Cell, it's their parents both carry sickle cell traits. But, I mean, the, both of the parents have sickle cell, but they give birth to a child that don't. Which is very, sales. very, very not likely. Even if you, even if both parents have sickle cell and you don't have sickle cell, you have the trait. Mm -hmm. So it's going to pass down to your next generation. So for you to not have it, that's where these black superheroes are coming from. And the people that have that not like the, the superhero or whatever power they have, 
they can touch people and cure their sickle cell. So now it's more so making it where it's like you are something that is very much wanted in the world. But only for one reason. It's crazy as fuck. Like it's a See, really good show. More of my reason is saying that's bullshit. <laughs> I can't hey, stand the you worst. I ain't never knew no black nigga that'd use a power to help other niggas out. But I say, nigga, A Train ain't wanna help nobody in the boys. You talking about nigga? A Train ain't wanna help his damn brother. His brother is the reason. His brother in a wheelchair because A Train. Damn right. See, that's what I'm saying. Like niggas get superpowers, but they gonna use it to for bad. But that's what the boys is about, though. I mean, mm-hmm. like, if I had superpowers, you, you got villains. You'd be a villain. Like, about the reason. I'd be like Robin Hood, though, like, real life. Like, I'd, I'd be, be an anti hero. All reason I said, mm, is because I heard two sides of the same like story. Hancock, bro. An anti hero. Yeah, yeah. He's an anti hero. I'm running around like Deadpool, nigga. I swear to God. Doing like, nigga, I'd be the nigga that, like, you just really never know what type of time I'm on. I'm really a villain, but, I'm, but it just depends on, like, how deep you know what I'm saying? It's only certain shit. It's, it's a lot of shit that I. It's a lot of shit that I won't do. He's still in, like, he's still in the grandma purse. Bus at the yeah, age. but I, but we can go rob the bank though. But we can't. <laughs> we ain't still in grandma bank. purse. Oh God, we can that's go me. That'd be me. Like, but we gonna go give back to the shorties in the hood. You know? Yeah, like I'm doing that type of shit. That that'll be what yeah, I'll be on. Mean, that's what I'm saying. Like I'll be yeah. a super. Or or you know if man? you just like if if it's a nigga that's just like. Using his power to just fuck the city up, I gotta go get him. I'm sorry. Like, you know, my race other races. Definitely. What? No, I ain't even gonna lie. Definitely. Definitely. Well, yeah, you, you gotta be walking down the street. Go, you gotta be walking down the street with a grenade launcher for me to for you to yeah. catch my attention. Yeah. Yo, mama just put in the comments. There's a series called The Oath that put that Fifty put out in 2008. It's dope. Uh, is that what it's about crooked you? cops and gangs. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, she you know she know about all. Say, if she says it's dope, we might have to see about that. <laughs> I was about to say, say two thousand and eight. He was producing. He was making. Jokes. <laughs> dyslexic. But he was though. What? Sorry, yeah, I'm really. dyslexic. I was about to say, Mama, I don't even remember two thousand eight for real. But <laughs> nah, two, nah. But if she saying it's on point, cause she where I think I get all the my love for the gangster shit from. It's it's. I'm, so, I'm already know. So she says at some point, I might need to go see about that and let y'all know. For what sure. is it on, though? Like, I'm going to have to go find something or something like that. Look it up. It's, it's probably on Prime or something. You just look it up on Google. They'll tell you where to watch it at. Yeah, on me. Shit, bro. What's your mama's favorite movie? Her favorite movie? You have to ask her. You have to ask her. Shoot. Um... Like, what's one gangster movie you've seen her watch multiple times? I know she put me on Goodfellas when I was in, like, middle school. Hey, Goodfellas like, was my she like, shit, bro. She's like, Milo, God. come here and watch this movie. She's like, you ever seen Goodfellas? I'm like, nah. She's like, come here and watch this movie with me. Yeah, this is a real good movie. Mm-hmm. And I've been hooked on it ever since. And that was in, like, 2012. The, I fuck with all the mob movies. Like, mob movies probably my favorite movies. Yeah. 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 I, 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 I think about the movie all the time. I waited until I got older to watch a lot of mob like, movies. Like, I just watched Scarface recently. I just watched The Godfather recently because as a kid if I would have watched it I wouldn't have gave a fuck about it I wouldn't have paid the real concept of it. I yeah. wouldn't have understood the it Godfather it took me to be like wrong it took me like you had to get older or something mm-hmm. to really, to really grasp it. what they own in that I movie like, playing with it, especially on Scarface because I used to think that was just a movie full of shooting and killing but like watching it like about like how they was going about shit like damn this shit is and then the historical the context too all of a nigga for real mm-hmm. we had this conversation all the time do y'all feel like Tony was wrong for killing dude his, his best friend no he 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 I feel like he felt betrayed. No, he wasn't wrong. I literally sat here and told you to leave my little my he little sister. He was betrayed. Alone. He told him not to do it. I don't want my little sister dealing with no nigga, no gangsters, no, no nigga nobody like that. I deal with. So I, I literally told you, and I told you, as soon as you even start, as soon as you even thought about it, I shut that shit down. And you want to go behind my back and marry her? He married her. He didn't just niggas make, I can't do a Scarface house. And he didn't just fuck her. He went behind this nigga back and married her. So you basically just said, nigga, nigga, fuck what you saying, nigga. Mm-hmm. Facts. Say so. Say less then. Yeah, I, yeah. I would have did the same thing. But I do feel like I do feel like if he wasn't so coked out, he probably wouldn't have killed that nigga. Probably beat his ass. And, that, and yeah, that's probably and that's fact. I feel like. He would at least talk to. Me. He would at least say Drugs something like a big part in it. And I feel yeah, they like did. They made, that they, they did. made sure that you've seen it. That like, the, that he was boy. You see out of his mind. Up. You see how turned up he got at the end of the movie. That nigga like, was in the pool. Did. Yeah, when he was in the I tub. Cockroaches. Bro, like nigga, he did that. He put his whole face in some coke, boy, what? and laid that niggas and just down. inhaled. Like, like, bro, he was laying. Bro, then you I, turn around. Not only do these niggas come up the stairs smoking your shit, <laughs> a nigga comes in behind. A nigga done repelled up the window, up the wall. Yeah, yeah, shot the shit out. That's why I thought he killed. Then the nigga come in and smoke your sister. He was sitting in the chair like this, watching. It's like, the fuck is he wrong? They came through. <laughs> yeah, ate her shit up. 
Then, bro, first of all, he's scandalous for leaving his 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 partners in them outside mm-hmm. that. Oh God, bro. they like Tony. Tony, <laughs> open the fucking door. Open the door, Tony. Hey, this nigga just sitting there hugging his sister like she ain't been and checked out ten minutes the ago. The fuck, bro? I ain't gonna hold you. That whole little scene was weird as fuck. It's cause like Tony, what, what, what's up with you and your sister, big yeah, dog? She came in that bitch crazy. Came in bro, that she was coked. She was coked, bro. She was no, no, she, she was drunk. I think, bro. <laughs> and she was coked up. And she, uh, yeah, if I say she had to snort some. Tony. Her, uh, her husband got her on this shit. She said she was already on the shit. Nah, because that's how he was acting all movie, and I ain't gonna fake, bro. I be saying that to niggas, bro. Like niggas who be overprotective for their sister, bro. What you you must like her or something? Like, bro, because that yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, that shit kind of weird, bro. I was never like that with my sister. Now, if it's like if a nigga mess with my sister, it's definitely gonna be up. But as far as like. Trying to bully niggas that she brung around and all that, but I don't give a fuck. You know, I don't give a fuck. Your hands on the touch. Go ahead, fun. Please go ahead, fun. Get the fuck out of my face. Why you say Sisters like girls. That's shit, true. I ain't gonna That's lie to you, shit. Like, That's not not if my sister put her hands on you first, I'm damn sure not finna come press you, you about it. it. If my sister like put, thug, if my sister put her hands on you first, defend yourself. By all means, please, like defend yourself, but don't get to just socking her out, bro. My but I ain't gonna lie, defend yourself like, though. And chubby dumb niggas. Both or you could just wait for me. Chubby dumb. Wait for me. Like, I'm gonna girl. come sock her out because she already that. know not to even. Don't even be doing that. Like, that's oh, wrong with Adam. Oh God, when I used to crash up my baby, they used to call my dad and my brother. And that would and that would have and that would have the same thing. Like, hey. Come get her. Come get her. It's been times where he didn't try to. My dad was like, "Get out the car." I told my daddy, "Fuck you." <laughs> this nigga got me fucked up. This is when I was pregnant, and that's exactly what he said. She crazy. I ain't dealing with this. Yeah, Fuck time. both of y'all. Literally. Don't the way my like, daddy hey, was because it's, it's, it's about to go there. I, God, I was I was six months pregnant. I was pissed. Oh, my yeah, hormones was everywhere. Hormones everywhere. And that's why my dad was like, "That's the only reason why I ain't snatch your stupid ass up. You out here pregnant, talking some fuck me." Yeah, fuck you. Why you in our problem? If I had a girlfriend and she had it in her. She had a daddy. I snitch on her ass every time, bro. Every time, I swear to God, oh, biggest bro. snitch. Be having daddy, so you can yeah, oh, yeah, fuck no. Niggas was the biggest. Shit. Every daddy. time I that would be I'm me. Telling your fucking dad, I'm, t- I'm snitching Bitch. on you. What? On God, and don't Tally. let you don't because let you have a mama with her head on straight. That too, he would call my mama and because, say because the, because let some shit ever hit he the fan. They're gonna have a me. documented history of your bullshit. <laughs> so I'm gonna at least get the benefit of the doubt. What? Because the day I super sock your ass, for you in here beating on me like I'm gonna have a. Documented history hey, of your understand. bullshit. What? So when I go upside your shit you one time, they're gonna at least give me the benefit. They ain't gonna side with me. That nigga went tripping. He didn't let that but shit. But they gonna give me the benefit of the doubt. Who the fuck gonna ghost? <laughs> ghost. She gonna say, "You see that ghost behind you?" What ghost? It was on the screen. That's why I said, "What fucking ghost?" I'm sorry, I'm drought. <laughs> okay, drought. what's up, drought? But yeah, I ain't, I ain't, I don't even play like that, bro. No. I, I swear to God, I don't even, I don't play the type of games, bro. Fuck around, get the Batista bomb in this motherfucker, boy. Fuck around with the wrong nigga. But now, nah, I'm just out trying to get the fuck about this motherfucker, man. To the far left, man, Hector Juan Carlos, give me a social shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bird. Big heck, low. Your just baby mom's favorite. Bio. Yeah, your baby mom's favorite. Somebody stole my name. No, it was your nigga. It was your what did it say? Yo. Yo, baby. Your baby. No, your mama. Your baby mama's, mama's favorite, favorite nigga. nigga. Yeah. So, nigga, whenever I find you, it was that Jimmy nigga that was singing. I'll tell you who it was. And feet on your bitch ass. Jimmy got sold. You didn't do Jimmy it last night. Sold. I didn't know who Jimmy it was. Got, they Jimmy, wouldn't Jimmy, got, Jimmy got sold. The nigga that was That's my movie. Jimmy I love that, that movie. Chocolate king. That nigga Jimmy early had me weak. That whole movie, bro. Nah, when he was funny. singing to that white woman on stage <laughs> and she had to leave with her husband and she oh, shit. I'm tired yeah. of singing slow songs and walking around. Hold on now. How you gonna kill us? Hit me! That nigga James Early funny, bro. I'm telling you. Y'all yeah, rude. Y'all just bought the bot on his Who? No, we didn't. I was done. I, I was just said I was gonna shit. beat that nigga ass though. I will I jump Jimmy on God. What the fuck you talking about? We're gonna jump Jimmy. I'm looking for this nigga named James still, bro. <laughs> and when I catch that nigga James, but boy, I swear to God, I'm James so mud hole. That nigga that stole his groceries. That nigga that stole his groceries. That nigga that stole his groceries. I knew exactly what he was talking about when he said that name. I called the. Nah, the bitch. My groceries. Nigga stole all. I mean, didn't leave a bag or nothing. Like, you bitch ass nigga. You better pray to God I'll never catch you, bro. That's $34.99 worth of bullshit. I'm gonna kick your ass when I see you, bro. You get your $34.99 back? That ain't the 
motherfucking principal. I'm still beat that yeah, nigga ass. He was talking spicy. Eating my food. Just, the fuck? Yeah, he shouldn't have stole his. Hey, he was talking crazy. My bitch must. Well, I put him at the wrong. Ad- I put him at the right address. You must have wrote the wrong shit. Bitch ass nigga. What address he put him at? And where you at? They be foul. And where you at? He was like, I'm not coming back. You better pray to God. I don't ever <laughs> see you, bitch ass nigga. <laughs> Ooh, you better pray. As I'm eating your food, like yeah, I put it at the right address. I remember some door dash. I remember the door dash. Somebody was door dashing some food when they dropped that shit off at my house. I guess it was to the apartment next door or something. Boy, I, I was running outside to go do something real quick. I, but I, I about tripped over the food. And I, I'm like, man, I instantly scooped that shit up, take him to the crib real quick. Thank go you. Outside, I'm not mad at that. Go outside, do what I need to do. I come back in the crib, boy. It's like two orders of pancakes, nigga, hash browns. I just boy. thought God from, blessed from, us. From, from corner buff- buffet. Blessing, that shit was a blessing. That's definitely a blessing. All I, 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 out of nowhere, I just hear the, um, the door dash just blaming on my door. I'm like, bro, You're over. this shit is halfway <laughs> done, bro. <laughs> it's over. Get away from my door, bro. Like, Nobody's here. I ain't even answer the door. Yeah, I ain't even answer the door because, bro, this, bro, I'm too busy <laughs> you slamming this shit. <laughs> Don't even. You might as well stop knocking, big dog. Hey, you get five stars with my Because what are you going to do, though? Like, are you going to. You want me oh, to God. give this? You want me to give this back to you? I seen this shit the other like $500 to the wrong person. That was like, shit. What you supposed to do with that? Like, you can't then come to my door, get the food, and then what? Take it to the customer? I could have did anything to this. Like, exactly. Just get the fuck I'm away from right my now, house. I gave it to the wrong person. Maybe I'll be a little more understanding. I feel like that. Yeah, almost he that took boy. it home. That bitch ass nigga took my shit and ran off with it. So when I catch that nigga, oh boy, boy, boy. He's still gonna be eating the chips that was in your. That's order. cool. I'm going to <laughs> eat the sleeves off that nigga. I swear to God. Nigga better save her. Every speck of dust. Every off fucking of bite of them Doritos, nigga. Oh, I swear God. to God, bro. And I got some pistachios, nigga. You know I love pistachios. How long did you wait? Bro, I was waiting for like a good two hours, bro. <laughs> like, I got, I, I woke up like around 8, 7, 8, whatever like that. The shit supposed to be delivered by 11. Nigga, he got the 12, 12 o'clock. Oh, nigga. I think Perry trying to tell us to go home. I'm bad. My bad. All right, we got here, y'all. Uh, those, Lonnie Vans, Naisky. Follow me on Instagram at Big underscore Nate A. I'm just playing. I'll be on there. Follow me on TikTok. Follow niggas. You know the vibes. We out. See you niggas next week. Cut the mic, Perry. This game big right there. So she over here with them yams out.